All right, so after a long day of working and doing a promo for Resistance, we are now at McDonald's. You can't see that. All right, got to remember my vlog camera for next time. So I'm going to figure out what is on the menu that I can only get in Spain and order that and do a little mukbang for you guys once I get home. What's up guys, it's B Mars from the Mukbang Monday channel and today I am eating something extra special for you, which is dun -da -da -da, McDonald's. Now, I don't normally go here that often. In fact, I don't even think we have a McDonald's mukbang on our channel besides when I went to Australia and I tried their gravy fries. So one thing that's really interesting to me is that there are so many McDonald's around the world and they always have specific items for that region. So whenever I'm in a new country now, I'm always like, hmm, what will this McDonald's have? And if you've also ever wondered these things, now you can just watch this video instead. <laughs> And if you like this idea and you'd like me trying McDonald's in other countries, make sure you let me know by giving this video a big thumbs up. Okay, so let's get into what we have here today. First, I've already drank some of it because I had to drive home. And my patience is this big. This is a McShake Lotus. So it's basically Biscoff cookie flavored. I always think of Biscoff cookies as the ones they give you in airplanes. But, uh... This shake is so good. I took all of my willpower not to suck it down in the 10 minute drive home from McDonald's. <laughs> yeah. And this right here is the Cheese and Ole Deluxe. I thought I ordered fries, but obviously I accidentally ordered potato wedges. Sorry my lighting is so bad. I'm obviously in my house in Ibiza and there isn't really any good lighting. But here we go. Ooh. So yeah, this looks like a potato wedge with cheese and then I don't know what the Olay sauce is, but it kind of looks like ketchup, but like orange and I'm hoping it's spicy. And these little guys right here are the Mick Croquetas de Jamon? Jamon? I obviously don't know how to say that correctly. Oh my God, this lighting. I'm trying guys. This is what we call ghetto rigging the mukbang. <laughs> anyway, and I don't even know, I honestly had never even heard of a croquetta or croquet before, but some of the other girls have, and it's a pretty popular tapa in Spain or in Spanish countries, so I'm super excited. I know this one has ham in it, but that's all I really know, so cheers. Mmm. It's basically a cheese ball. Mm. Maybe I'm wondering if the lighting would be better if I like bounced it off the wall. Would that look good, guys? Maybe I'll show you. What I really want to try is one of these potato guys. See that cheese? And that's the Olay sauce. Mmm. Oh my god. This is everything. I would say the Olay sauce is almost like a mild salsa or taco sauce. It's really good. Not spicy, which is unfortunate for me, but some people would rather that. Mm. It's funny, usually I'm not like a potato wedge person. I'd much rather a french fry, but I'm kind of glad I made the mistake. Sorry if you can hear people. I, I locked myself in one of the rooms so I could record this. All right, let me show you the inside of this. See that? It looks like, honestly, mozzarella cheese. I don't know what kind of cheese it is, don't quote me on that. If you look really closely, you can see there's little bits of ham. Three very solid items, McDonald's. I'm wondering, let me know, leave in the comments below if you're from a different country, if 
there is something in the US at McDonald's that is like just in the US. Cause I don't really know what would be for our region. But then like, do people in Spain just think that these are normal McDonald's items and they don't know that they're only regional? Do you know what I mean? Honestly though, I don't think we have anything cool at in the ones in the States. Mm. These are messy y'all. I wish I grabbed a fork. So as you guys know, I am in Ibiza. Actually, you might not know that. I shouldn't assume, I'm sorry. If this is your first ever video watched, welcome to our channel. Please hit that subscribe button down below. We post videos on Mondays and Wednesdays, sometimes Fridays. And by we, I mean me and my partner, Chantal. But sometimes we do solo videos and I'm living in Ibiza until the end of August. So you are gonna see a couple solos. Mm. Um, I'm working for a show called Resistance. So what's what's weird about not weird, but the thing in Ibiza is you have these clubs and then there are parties that are thrown at each club. So like Monday could be this party, but Tuesday could be a different party and it's completely different, but it's at the same place. So I'm a dancer for the resistance party at Privilege in Ibiza. Mm. So every Tuesday night, I dance from 1 a.m. till 6 a.m. It's crazy, the clubs here do not end until like 7 or 8 a.m. and it's like, people start going out around 1. It's like, in the US, I feel like you go out probably around 11 and the bars close at like two. So, it's been an adjustment. <laughs> My sleep schedule is non-existent. <laughs> but, it's cool. I have to do like promo, so like I'm wearing a t-shirt. So we'll walk around the whole town and we hand out like flyers or free shirts or whatever and like just promote and tell people about the party. I'm so sorry if I'm a little dead. It's 2 a.m. right now. I just got back from working. So yeah, we walk around the town Tuesday, or oh my God, what? Sunday night. Monday and Tuesday day, we do promo on the beach where we literally walk down the beaches with signs and music to advertise for the show. And then basically the rest of the week we have free. But there's always like random things we have to do. Like there's a family dinner or we have to do a shoot. Like, but that could happen on any of, you know, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, Sunday. We usually have like two or three days of free time, which has been really amazing. Mm. I miss Chantal. I miss my cat. I really miss my boyfriend. I've probably been here for two weeks. Oh God, I don't even know. That means I have like a whole month to go. <laughs> I try not to think about it. Honestly, time does not exist here. A pizza is like its own planet. Yeah. It's really fun, but honestly, so exhausting. And almost everyone you meet here, nobody actually like lives here. They come here and work for the summer because that's when everyone comes to 
per day. But I've seen some really cool like old school statues and beaches and I'm trying to make sure I do like touristy stuff too and not just party all the time. Mm. Mm. Okay, well this has been great. I can't finish this because I'm actually going to pass out. I am so tired. Mm. I definitely recommend if you go to Spain, get these cheese and aioli or ole sorry cheese and ole potato wedges they are bomb dot bomb these are okay too but these are like how the bowels also i want you guys to comment below what your favorite thing to get at mcdonald's is what's your like go-to order and also if you're in a different country <laughs> what's in your country that we can't get other places i think that's so interesting and then if I go to that country, I want to make sure I try it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, and I'll see you next time. Whatever Wednesday out.